Deputy Director General of the Ghana Health Service, Dr. Anthony Adofuofusu, has appealed to the managers of the Northern Electricity Company, NETCO, to rescind its decision that led to the disconnection of major health facilities, including the Bono East Regional Cold Room, as part of its mass revenue mobilization and disconnection exercise. He said the situation is adversely affecting general health care as thought vaccines worth several millions of cities are likely to go waste. And as Sabit has more. The Northern Electricity Distribution Company has as part of its mass revenue mobilization and disconnection exercise disconnected power supply to some major health facilities across the Bono East Enclave and this includes the regional cold room which is under the Bono East Regional Health Directorate. The issue of electricity supply to our facilities as Ghana Health Service has been a source of concern for us. I mean, we understand the ECGs and NETCO and all the uh, this and that. I mean, they also need money to pay for the power that they procure. But then it should be done in the context that certain areas are critical. I mean, and some way need to be found that they are not made victims of a system. And that is our concern because we've negotiated with them over this. But then along the line, then you go back again. Yeah, because it looks like that's the underbelly of the crocodile and then you try to hit and then you try to see his arm twisting technique to try and get your money. But I don't think it's the best move and I think they need to rethink of, around it. The situation, according to the Deputy Director General of the Ghana Health Services, Dr. Antonio Adolfo Ofusu, is worrying and continue to serve as a threat to general health care, which will in the long term contribute to epidemics in children who may not be vaccinated due to this decision. This cold room stores vaccines that have been bought by the government themselves and then partners at huge cost. And you all remember the uproar that we had in the country with the vaccine shortage. I mean, when there was vaccine shortage, because what it means is that children do not get vaccinated and then it will lead to epidemics. So disconnecting cold rooms in a bid to recover your money from the government, I don't think it's a wise decision. And I think they need to rethink about it. He was, however, quick to send a passionate appeal to managers of the Northern Electricity Distribution Company to rescind its decisions by reconnecting the various health installations across the region, adding that health is critical. And even though NETCO needs the monies to survive, there is currently no budget to take care of that. My plea to them that they should understand that, I mean, these are critical facilities that are needed for the whole public health. And because the bottom line is that we, have, we do not have allocation in our budget to pay for it. So we need to find a way of negotiating a way in which it will be conducive for all. We understand that they also have bills to pay. But then, I mean... He should understand that health is critical and we need to understand how we can without using this arm twisting technique that they are using. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Tichima.